Mr. Lister was a white man. Written and illustrated by Rocky Randall. Mr. Lister was a white man before it was a crime. Every day he'd go to work. Mr. Lister was a mime. His wife stayed home to keep the house going. She did all the cooking, the cleaning, and the sewing. Did I mention the Listers had 12 kids and one in the oven? That's right, the Listers had a baker's dozen. Snowflake City was full of white men once upon a time. But something strange happened. Being white became a crime. They closed down his business without further ado. They fired Mr. Lister and his friend Mr. Black too. Quickly the men of the town made up new races. They wore different clothes and they painted their faces. Suddenly being white was uncouth. But no one knew why, to tell you the truth. Then Mr. Lister said to his wife, I have a brilliant plan. I'll start a career as a face painting man. The years went by, and Mr. Lister climbed the ladder. His kids grew up, and he got grayer and fatter. The snowflakes began asking Mr. Lister for advice. What's the best color, they asked. We'll pay any price. They got tired of red and blue, tired of green and yellow. So Mr. Lister smiled and looked down at this one fellow. Since all that time passed, the snowflakes just forgot. Most colors were allowed, but white was not. So Mr. Lister went inside and got his old white paint. The snowflakes stood in line for something new, something quaint. And just like that, would you believe the mimes were back? As for Mr. Lister, he retired along with his friend, Mr. Black.